The Palm Beach County leaders are hopeful that FEMA will soon be granting individual assistance to dozens of people without a place to live due to those tornadoes caused by Hurricane Ian. Good evening, I'm Tiffany Kenny, And I'm Felicia Rodriguez. Thank you for joining us. Our Steve King is live for us at Kings Point in Delray Beach, the hardest hit area during last week's storm. Steve, where does the process of getting help for those residents stand tonight? Felicia, Tiffany, well, there were some damage assessments last week, and right now more damage assessments are taking place here in Kings Point, where 58 units are now uninhabitable, like this one right behind me. FEMA, other federal officials, county and state leaders were all out here doing some more damage assessments today. Here's District 5 Commissioner Maria Sachs speaking with FEMA officials who were in Kings Point throughout the day. Sachs says she and other county leaders are doing everything they can to get Palm Beach County added to this list, the counties eligible for individual assistance through FEMA following Hurricane Ian. We're in need, so whatever it takes, the county has done our due diligence in getting the documentation to Washington, D.C. We've reached out to our uh, federal partners. Federal officials say the state must request individual assistance through FEMA and today I received this response from the Florida Division of Emergency Management which reads in part quote we have state staff in the field with the county actively conducting assessments to assist in providing support to determine Palm Beach County's eligibility for recovery programs. Determining exactly what programs can be turned on for Palm Beach directly correlates to the findings our staff find in the damage assessments. However, neither the state nor FEMA have shared a timetable as to when a decision will be made. For people like Leonardo Gomez, a board secretary at Normandy 5 in Kings Point, the wait is causing a lot of stress. His unit was not hit, but several units in his building are now condemned. He says his displaced neighbors are constantly asking him for updates. I really feel helpless. I would like to uh, be able to help uh, with some you know, information, some positive information. I the information I have is scarce and it's uh, not what they want to hear and um, I, uh, I'm afraid for them. I don't know if they're going to come back. Now, U.S. Representative Lois Frankel, who is out here today for those assessments, says she's confident that FEMA is going to make Palm Beach County eligible for individual assistance at some point, though she did not say when she expects that to happen. As for the management property here, Vesta, Vesta Property Services, they are providing some financial assistance to the people displaced by the storm. Reporting live in Delray Beach, Steve King, WPBF 25 News.